fucking cold. What are we talking about first? Are we gonna keep everything on the desk and talk about it all? No. Hello! Welcome to episode two! We did it! Two episodes! What? Hooray! No way. I'm impressed. I'm super impressed. So. I, th I think that we should start by thanking our sponsors. Who? We have sponsors? Yes. Ourselves. Is we it Bank Square? Well, I was, well, coffee. Okay. Coffee is a sponsor. Mm -hmm. Thank you, coffee. Bank Square particularly, not coffee in general. Right? In Beacon, New York. I, I think we should thank art. Okay. The intangible I think we need sponsors. Yes. Of, of art. Thanks. What did happen? What happened last week? We just had an awesome gallery <laughs> show. The Glow Show 2. We talked about it a little bit last week. Um, it was an awesome opening. It went super, super well. It was slammed. Uh, if you ever come to Beacon, when you're walking up and down Main Street on Second Saturday, everywhere looks just about the same. It's, you know, sort of folk art and glass and things like that. And then you walk by clutter and it's all black lights and beer and nonsense <laughs> and loud music. And it was super, super fun. Tons of people came out. Uh, the show sold really well. Congratulations to all the artists. It, uh, it was a great it opening. It glowed really well. It glowed really, Thank really well. Thank you for well. making things glow. That was the point. It we appreciate worked. it. It looks really cool. Hopefully next year will be even bigger and better. I'm going to keep doing it every year. I had a show too this weekend. You did. Crystal, Crystal Ocean. Crystal Ocean. What did you release? We released a family of Octodrops. Last week we didn't get to show you the actual colorway of the Octodrop XL. So this week... We can. we can. We can. There's still a few available, so if you did want to grab one, they're here and they're beautiful. This is the Tree Frog Edition. It is, has an interior glow-in-the-dark green and black octo with an exterior smoke. Uh, it's limited to 30 pieces. 30 pieces. Um, they're on pre-order now. They're beautiful. They're huge. They are murder toys because they are heavy. They're very heavy, so you could hurt someone yeah. with it. They are a weapon. They're beautiful. Um, we also had on display a bunch of other prototype colorways that we haven't released yet, we'll be releasing in the future. A lot of them are the big companion to the releases we've already done in the smaller sizes. There's also a few new we colorways yes, that yeah. uh, came out really, really nice. But everybody wants all of them in the same color scheme so they can have all the sizes, so we make sure that happens too. Nice. We also released the Radioactive Edition, which is... Pink and blue internal gossamer, like the MVHs you may have seen that we've done. Yeah. Um, this is the one that we talked about. It's glittery. We talked about this a little bit last week. Yeah. So we had 50 of these. Oh, this one is $300. $300. This one's $150. And then for $50, you can get the little baby. It is, um, this one is... Steel. Steel color. It's like a, a silver uh, internal with a smoke external. So it's really pretty. And that's limited to 100 at $50. Uh, and there are still some available as of filming and probably as of release, so you can go to clutter.co yeah. and grab one. What else happened last week? So last week we got to go and see Motion City Soundtrack play in New York at Webster Hall and in New Jersey at Stalin Ballroom. It was super awesome. Many moons ago, back when we were a magazine in England, the keyboard player subscribed to the magazine and I was like, oh, one of the guys from Motion City Soundtrack subscribed. And that was all that I thought about it at the time. And now, fast forward 15, 16 years now. I don't know how long it's been. Math. A long time. And math, math, math years math, forward. Math years, math years forward. Math, yes. math years forward. Mm -hmm. and, and so we got to go and hang out with them. I want to say thank you for all the cold cuts. <laughs> Yeah, we took them a bag of toys, so hopefully they had a good time with those. Really cool to know that there's this mutual like love of art and music and toys. And I think there's quite a few bands in that world that do that. You know, there's My Chemical Romance, who have toys and comics, and Cohen and Cambria, who also have independent comics and toys. Um, Pro Lesson J, yeah. Fall Out Boy had yeah. Luke Chu on the cover. Uh, Motion Soundtrack had Joe Ledbetter do their cover, they also made a toy. Yeah. So there's, you know, there's all this crossover between that style of music and what we do. So it's always great to have that come full circle and for us to be able to meet them and talk about it and get excited about toys and music. And we're always trying to find a way to get 
music into what we do, whether it's making toys or whether it's bringing music into Five Points, which we still haven't really quite figured out, but it's something that we talk about every year. Do we have any toys coming out that are music related? Give me the loop, give me the loop. Give me the loop, give me the loop. We have the next colorway of the Biggie drop in, the Give Me the Loot colorway. Whoa, that's sick. He looks like the Statue of Liberty. He does. Covered in money. All of the money. He's limited to 100 pieces, costs $150 each. We'll release Thursday at noon at clutter.co. Our first video, we talked a bunch about the Biggie toy and its background and all of that. We've you released. You should go watch that. You should go watch yeah. that. You should subscribe, subscribe and watch and you know be awesome to us. Yeah. The sixth colorway dropping, I believe. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So this is the sixth colorway dropping. Removable crown, glasses, chain. He's got accessories and a little hoodie on. And he he's is, made of money. He's made of money. He's like he looks like the Statue of Liberty. I mean, it's just. Awesome. It's super awesome. You want one. It's one of my favorite colorways. It's beautiful. It's really cool. Um, if you have the others, you're definitely gonna want this one. So set your alarms. Big up, big up. It's a stick up, stick up. Give me the loop, give me the loop. Okay. Do you what, want... what do you have over there, Josh? Yeah, what's in front of you? What's uh, this new secret thing to talk about? So today? we are really excited because we got the vinyl prototype in for CZ's new cookie head on the Kanzi body. Oh, we haven't talked about... I was say, what's a Kanzi? What's a Kanzi? What's a Kanzi, Joe? After uh, a few months now of releasing CanBots, we all came to the realization that we have a lot of different heads coming out on the body uh, that CZ created, and they're not all bots, so it didn't really make sense anymore, and we wanted it to be a little bit more expansive, so we all put our heads together and came up with the name Kanzi, which is rad because it's about the can and it's about CZ and it's just it just rolls off the tongue. The series of these vinyl toys is going to be called the Cookie Cat Crew. And we don't have official names of the colors yet, but there's three colorways coming out and I'm going to name them right now. Nightwing, <laughs> Blue Angel, and Tony the Tiger. Pretty sure all of those are trademarked. They're officially Nightwing, <laughs> Tony the Tiger, and Blue Angel. Do we have an idea of when they're dropping? These should be here for release in the next few weeks. So we'll, in a few weeks, show you those when we have the actual colors and it's not just a prototype. Um, they look really cool. And I think Cece will be here so he can tell us Cece will be them. here. He'll be on video We'll put subtitles on for him. Oh, shit. <laughs> But not for me, just him. Uh, so we're super, super excited because look at them together. <laughs> look how cool these guys are together. They're just best friends. They are. They're red. And of course, there's more heads coming out. There's more awesome Kansies coming out. Uh, and we're just really, really excited about this next release. These guys are so cute. I've seen some of the paint ups at the factory. Uh, they're looking great. Really, really excited. And again, this is a prototype vinyl. It won't be this. It won't like, be this beige weird. brown color. It'll be a really unbaked fun. cookie. I need to be baked more. Might be baked more. <laughs> there you go. Cool. Girls and boys, man. Girls and boys. In other news, you want to know when the next little quickie is going to be released. It's black and gold. It's super awesome. It's dropping with our friends at IamRetro.com. The only way to buy it is to make sure that you're on that newsletter because it's going to be a newsletter sent out and then you'll click the link, you'll buy it. I don't think it's going to be on the website just as like you can go and find it. Mm. Um, we're not 100% sure right now while we're recording this, but we think that's what's happening. So go to IamRetro, sign up for their mailing list. Uh, we'll be posting about it on our Instagram. Yeah. Make sure you're following IamRetro on Instagram as well for all the updates on this new drop. And CZ and Quicks, follow those too. At CZ13R and at, at Quicks. Quicks. Next up at Clutter Gallery is In Action Figures 8. Wow. Um, it's the 8th annual version of our action figure show, which celebrates... Um, bootlegs. Bootlegs. Puns. <laughs> and <laughs> resin. <laughs> Mashups. And... Cultural icons. Yes. Yeah. The heyday of the action figure. The 70s and 80s. Yes but mixed with like modern concepts and yeah. characters. Retro, and... throwback, music, comedy, you name it. It's Superheroes. 
political. Star Wars. The internet. It's always a huge show. We always have a ton of artists, like 50, 60 artists take part. Um, a lot of artists come to this show. It's a really nice place for them to all get together once a year. Um, so I'm sure that's going to happen again. It's fun. Come to the opening, 8th of February, second Saturday. Um, we also have uh, Nights of Slice here doing their third show with us yes. this year. And they've got um, new stuff. And new stuff. It's going to be very fun. Yeah. So, so and it's sponsored by Lagunitas. Sponsored by Lagunitas. So they'll be beer. Thank you, Lagunitas. You rule for always keeping us supplied. Do we have anything else to talk about this yes. week? Five points no. fest. May 30th, 31st this year. Tickets will be going on sale this week. Um, we're super excited to reveal what the exclusive VIP toy will be. Um, if you're a vendor and haven't heard from us, we will be getting back to you ASAP. We're just really busy right now. Uh, Artist Alley vendors will be hearing back from us very, very soon, and then we'll be doing a second round of those. So hold tight, Artist Alley vendors, we're getting to you. We think you're awesome. We're so excited that you all applied. Thank you. Yeah, we have so much awesome stuff happening this year for Five Points. Um, we'll start to leak and tell you about bits of it we as soon as we can. We have super exciting news <laughs> coming out about years. Design Toy Awards. Yeah, yeah. In, in Ten this, years this year. Ten years of Design Toy Awards. This year is the 10th annual. So, that's crazy. Make sure you all get involved. Everybody nominate, everybody vote. I think that's it for this week. Anything else you got to say? There's always tons more that we could talk about, but I think that's we'll good save for, stuff for next yeah, week. that's good for now, yeah. and you know we'll we'll show you more stuff that's going on next week. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, follow us, Clutter Magazine at Clutter Magazine, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. You'll find us. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. Drop us a DM. You know anything you want us to talk about? Any questions you want to ask about vinyl, toys, art, anything? Drop us a line, and we'll answer them next week. Bye. Bye. This week I'm a gorilla. Barfs vomit <laughs> evil. <laughs> I am a cookie. <laughs>